she gave me a number, now I got a block it I'm mixing the dirty bills in with the profit Clean that shit up and I give it right back to him If I don't fuck with him, then I can't rap with him I wanna beat it when somebody catches him I wanna witness and see that shit It's your boy Jer03 aka Young Astro And bro, they did it again, man I'm, I'm really losing faith in 2K But I'm not gonna get into it till later in the video But I just want you to pay attention to how many alley-oops I'm getting and how much I had by halftime. Look, I have 41 by halftime. And majority of those are alley-oops. I didn't get the whole thing because I wasn't going to do a video with this footage. But I had to after I seen the end of it. But I'm just getting lob after lob. And I'm using the same method I've been using. But I'm going to just show you guys how to get a lot of VC. You got to be patient though. You do have to be patient because they're banning people for the, all the little VC glitches and stuff. So I don't have a VC glitch. I have a legit way to get... VC of course it's a grind though so just keep that in mind that it's not gonna just come from wherever it's gonna be you having to work for it though but like I said it is fast I've already almost have a hundred K and it's been like it's been a couple of games it's been a lot of games I'm gonna say that much but like I said if you save you'll be straight uh one thing I do have to add though for my method is definitely try to get them to pass you the ball regularly and try to dunk it like don't don't try to always alley-oop it try to get them to pass you the ball while you're cutting and then dunk it because the hall of fame cpu is so thirsty no matter what you do if you're already in an animation coming to the rim they're gonna try to cut you off and you'll get the posterizer posterizer doesn't pop up unless they're in the restricted area and sometimes it still doesn't pop up i don't know what's what goes on with it sometimes it'll be behind you it'll pop up sometimes it'll be in front of you and it won't pop up so i don't know what the deal is on that but you know it happens and sometimes it doesn't happen it doesn't make a whole bunch of sense like there you'll definitely see posterizer because they're right there but they have to be in the restricted area pretty much but you can't control that but with hall of fame they always close out so don't worry about that they always close out hall of fame right there you see a baseline dunk you get a i, I got posterizer on that one i should show you but i got posterizer on that one and you don't get it there see it's so it's kind of wishy-washy but i do get a lot in this game i get a pretty decent amount of them and that's what we have to do now like we literally have to dunk on people take advantage of your hall of, of your takeover though too because you can just bully people if you have a completely slasher build or if you have slasher primary then you have to just be a bully once you get the takeover and he's gonna do some nonsense layups but you have to just keep on grinding through it it's it's like i said it's frustrating and they made it even worse now so you're gonna have to do stuff like that if the paint's open drive in call for a regular pass and dunk it it's like i said it's crazy but you have to do that now because of what they done did with the dang game so that's really all i got to tell you other than what endorsements i use to get as much vc per game as i get i mean you guys might be getting a lot too i'm not too sure but Plus endorsements and plus uh, what you get. I don't even have max salary, so I get a lot based on what I what I do. I get a pretty decent amount. Um, I'm gonna, of course, go for the max once I hit the uh, once I hit, hit my next year. I think I think this year on 2K, on um, uh, my my career, I hit the uh, end of my uh, contract, so I'll be able to get the full amount. But look right here, man. Look right here. This is where I get pissed. All right because look at this right here you can see right here i only get 13 alley-oop finishes and i'm like okay i stopped doing alley-oops when i hit like 71 points because that way i can guarantee i hit at least 25 of them but that's not the case i know i did more than 13 i know i did more than 13 in the last in the second half so i don't know what was going on there so i was just like you know what we're just gonna keep it rolling maybe i didn't do as many as i thought and then i'd go and look at the posterizing dunks that's what you want to do with posterizing dunks you get 21k if you do 20 of them i don't know if that's the cap or whatnot and i get 62k which is still pretty good and here is what i'm talking about is you see right here the gatorade is incentives is 2140 now that's with that being said that's how i know i got fleeced on my dang on my alley use because i did way more than 13. so all right let's look at it right here so go to your your endorsements if you do get a chance and you're starting over you get your gator endorsements you have to get the get the 60 for three alley-oop games because 
but see like right here you see I, I got the hundred for the fair of the game one I didn't get any double doubles so I know I didn't get that one so I definitely got the player of the game and then I got the three alley-oop games so that means if I do the math correctly 60 2000 divided by 60 is definitely not 13 so I know I did at least 30 I think six yeah 60 times about 30 that's um, almost 2000 so clearly they took that away from us too so I guess if you miss an alley-oop it does not count it does not add up to your total if you miss one it takes it away so that's another thing they took from us I'm not even as mad as I was before just I don't know just it's been your boy jr03 aka your astro expect some more vids i'm gonna see y'all soon peace